Russian officials identify him as Ryan Fogel. They say he's a CIA spy who was trying to recruit a Russian operative to spy for the Americans. In a YouTube video released by Russia's RT television, a Russian intelligence official is heard angrily chastising him. You know perfectly well that recently the FSB is actively helping in the investigation of the bombing in Boston. But the man videotaped by Russian officials wearing a ridiculous wig seems to have a background that's not so ridiculous. According to officials at schools we contacted, officials who've looked at these pictures of him, this is likely the same Ryan Fogel who grew up near St. Louis, went to Mary Institute and St. Louis Country Day School, a private institution that costs nearly $23,000 a year for the upper grades. Fogel graduated from Mary Institute in 2002. Then, according to school officials, he went to Colgate University in upstate New York. There, by all accounts, he was a straight arrow and an achiever, a member of Phi Delta Theta, a fraternity that does not allow drinking in its houses. And he was selected for the Conocioni Senior Honor Society, a prestigious group with only 26 members. Um, Professor Fred Chernoff said Ryan Fogel was a student of his in a class on national security. He says Fogel's interest was in Middle East politics, and a class trip to meet diplomats stands out. Ryan was um, especially strong in the way that he posed questions. He was prepared for the meetings that we had with diplomats. Fogel graduated from Colgate in 2006 with a double major in political science and international relations. But his apparently fast-track career may have hit a snag. Intelligence experts say if he is in the CIA, he'll never be able to go back to Russia and likely won't work undercover again. We called and emailed a St. Louis area couple who we strongly believe are Ryan Fogel's parents to see if they would comment on the story. We did not hear back. The CIA has also not commented, Wolf.